Hey guys, how's it going? Mr. Bandles one here. It is time for some more Divinity Original Sin. This right here is the legendary item we just picked up over here from the boss. It is a dex based um, what is it? Leather brigandine. So it's like armor, chest armor. Strength, constitution, inflict poison on contact. Looks pretty nice, but we don't have any dex user, unfortunately. <clears throat> Someone blood swarm might be good. Now the only good thing about it is that it can attack like potentially up to four times, three to four times. But other than that, it's pretty weak. But anyway, let's go ahead and I think we need to finish the imp quest. Yep. So we're gonna do that. Uh, the Legend of the Ware Ship. I'm not too sure how to complete that yet. Let's go here. So what does it say? Found the recipe for making Ware Ship. We need to fire Ware Ship wool within an elemental forge. Oh, Ware Ship. I didn't find... I need to find a Ware Ship first though. Okay, so the, the imp is right here down where his supposed master used to be but he's not here anymore because we decided not to help him and he just vanished somehow but yeah so about that worship oh master my master cold and dead taken before his time well I'll Rip in just peace. be on my way then can I shoot him? Oh, 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 wait a minute. The imp ran away after finding his master dead. Now he is free. <laughs> and we killed him. <laughs> uh, that was terrible of us. I'll take it. I got some people that needed that XP. Oh, oh, we got talents and stuff. I totally forgot about that. Okay guys, so this is what I decided to go with. For Scarlet I went with... I think I got her, yeah, I got her 5 in Geomancer. And grabbed like Blood Swarm and Immune to Poisoning, which is kinda shitty because it has a range of 5 meters and it lasts 2 turns. Like, what the fuck? But whatever. We can get it now since it's free, because we can get as many spells as we like. And I mainly got it because we got Nature's Curse, which is a pretty good spell, but it is level 16 still. And the Summon Earth Elemental, which I'm really excited about. But yet again, it is level 16. So I'm definitely looking forward to that. Then I grabbed Light Stepper, which gives her 2 Perception Bonus for detecting traps and secrets. So I'm really making her a Perception Powerhouse. And I also want to get like bigger and better and invest another perception point in there. I'm gonna max out her perception. She already has like 17 intelligence, so she's pretty, she's pretty tough. She doesn't need any more intelligence. Speed, yeah, she has glass cannon, no need for that. Constitution, it's whatever. We're gonna get that from items. And yeah, perception is the focus here. Then Johan, I'm saving the 4 points because I need 5 for Aerotherge so then I can have both Hydrosphys and Aerotherge maxed out which will be really awesome and then I grabbed him no it all I believe or bigger and better one of the two and I grabbed him another intelligence point because why the hell not Madora I grabbed her um, bigger and better and I gave her a point in speed because she needed that one extra speed point in order to get more action points per turn and Roderick I gave him I think the same thing bigger and better and I chose speed again because he had 10 so if it's 11 he's gonna get yet another action point per turn so that this is really awesome and he's also immune to slow and why is he immune to slow, which gives him immunity to slow? 
He's in the helmet. Um, the belt. Immunity to slow. There we go. The boots gives him immunity to slow. So these boots are really fucking awesome. And the points. I guess I'm saving them for maybe for leadership five. Or I'm not. I'm not yet sure what I'm gonna do because I don't really know if I can grab another leadership point from items or if it's all only from helmet which I already have so I'm gonna have to just look look up on every single shop before I make such a decision but yeah there we go now what else do I want to do we got this one here we need to fire worship wool uh, I haven't found a worship yet so we can really do that. However, if you're gonna excuse me for a little bit, I'm gonna go and kill myself some freaking death knights. And it looks like I can't go to the fucking cave any or yeah to the mine anymore, which is really weird. We're gonna have to walk over there. But yeah, I got this whole death knight bane shenanigan going on so this is gonna be really cool are they walking you sons of bitches come on can I really not go down there god I wish I could just throw a pyramid down there um you know what screw those death knights I'm gonna go into this doomed area I think it's this way, right? Yeah, because there are some uh, hellhounds or something like that. Those void wolves that are that have invincibility, and then I can uh, make them uh, mortal again with that deathbane skill. And we got also got this guy. Now did I? Oh, I already botched his quest up. Pretty sure of it. My friend returns. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Th those um, cultist dudes. My we just we fucking kill them, mate. If they Until didn't want to leave. So up there's. Now the thing is, we are warm, so I really gotta be careful with with uh, using my perception skill here but here looks like it's alright so we're gonna start using our perception again so there are some demon dudes here and a lot of, all, a lot of other shenanigans now what exactly do we want to do here I'm not sure but I'm gonna try and find that out I think we need to talk to those guys. We may have talked already, but I don't remember. Oh shit! These are actually not immune. They have void aura, but I, f I fought them before. Yep. Oh, I think these guys. They were like, hey, you're not allowed to be in here, and we reached a diplomatic solution with them. Don't think there's anyone that is relevant to the quest here. What is this? Oh, it's a bedroll. Okay. Yeah. Oh, wait a minute. Maybe there's someone here. Do list. Priest, Marksman, Assassin... No, it's just an ordinary camp and we've already looted that. Oh, and there's... Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. This teleports us to those hellhounds there. So let's go here. We get like 13 perception with all this shit. Hell yeah. I'm not gonna have any secret... ...to go unnoticed. Okay, so we got spotted by the Immaculate Enchanter, which is kind of weird. Why doesn't he 
And these aren't immune either. They only have void auras. Okay, and they are actually pretty low on HP. But I guess they can run pretty fast. So I'm gonna start summoning some dudes, I guess. Actually, I'm gonna summon the Blood Swarm. Let's do it. Aha! <clears throat> Actually, let's try Death Knight Bane. Bypass Death Knight Invulnerability. I don't think it will do, I don't think it will do anything, though. Uh, here. Let's not do that. Let's just use Bless on these guys. There we go. And maybe you want to go back a little bit because this guy looks a bit menacing. Although he is a melee. But maybe he has like some teleporting shenanigans. Which might cause some problems. Can I not? There we go, summon him there. Hopefully he doesn't die from the lava there. Okay, good shit, good shit. <clears throat> Come on, Madora. Am I gonna have to ram? I don't wanna do that. Oof. I'm just gonna knock him out. There we go. And save the points. And rather, look at this shit. He starts off with 11 action points. That's pretty ridiculous. Summon the baby over there. Can I? I can encourage. I can lower resistance. I can bless. Let's just encourage. Aha! Okay, Blood Storm. It is your time to shine. 91%, hell yeah. Look at that, 1, 2, 3, 4. It's pretty good. Boom. Disease failed though. It's kinda disappointing. Okay. He's gonna... Oh, he's gonna turn himself invisible. And then he's gonna drink a potion. Doesn't that reveal him? Oh, wait a minute, he made the assassin invisible, I see. Okay, bro. You sneaky bastard. Have some of that. Why aren't dogs doing anything though? They are right there. Void ram. Wait a minute, are they like... Peaceful? What is going on in here? Maybe I'm gonna be able to talk to them. That would be cool be pretty rad indeed. Okay, Scarlet, um, that guy is pretty boned. Let's take care of this guy over here. Let's have a boulder. Boom. What do we have to say about that? Can I use spores? Nope. Can't really use anything here. So, how about just use blisters? There we go. A blessing for you, a blessing for you, a blessing for everyone! Okay, Johan. You can do some teleportation. Actually, yeah. Come over here. Aha! Sup, sucker. I'm gonna just shoot you. Boom. Okay, Madora. Just kill him. There we go. And just pass. And fist him. And we're gonna have our pets take care of him. Let's go, Blood Swarm. Damage. Good shit, good shit. Yeah, he's still pretty healthy. We're gonna need our Ice Elemental in here. Oh, Ice Elemental got poisoned. Okay. Can I do anything? I think I could try doing this. No. I 
can try. Oh, I got another boulder. Sure. Boom. There we go. Done. So what now? Let's just save and see what happens. I'm gonna use perception. Boom. Let's see if we can talk to these guys. No, they look... They look hostile to me. So let's start summoning dudes, I guess. One there. Oh shit, that was quick. Why weren't they attacking us when we were here? Like, what? But fine with me. Okay then. Why can I not hit all those three? Okay, I should be able to do this. Okay, see how this goes. Oh! Oh, so they are invulnerable. Wait a minute. Shit. This is not good. Not good at all. Use blind, maybe? Okay, you got me good. How about some of this? Did that work? Or what? Hopefully it did. Because otherwise it would be pretty disappointing. Do I want to test this out right now? No, I think I want to summon a spider first. There we go. That thing is four action points, unfortunately. Okay, another spider. Use this, but it doesn't tell me though. Voidora. Oh, maybe they are only immune to earth damage. I guess that might be the case. Let's try and use this. Invulnerable. What the hell? I think we need to kill this shepherd dude. Or are they immune to everything except water or something? This is really annoying. Like what the hell is this shit? What is going on? I don't think I have any lore master to see that exactly. Freaking void rams dude. Do they have attack of opportunity? I don't think so. Yep, invulnerable. I need to kill this guy. Really. You son of a bitch. Aha. Uh -huh. Might be able to do something here. Let's hope it doesn't fall on the ice. Huh, get him. Boom, bitch. Get wrecked. Who's next? He is next. Fireball on himself. Cool. I like that. And he's coming towards us. Okay, we pretty much need to bail out with Scarlet. So... Yeah, because she's not going to be able to do shit. So maybe... No, I don't want him. Like, I got... Where's my thing? I got three lore masters. It's really annoying. And I lost my ability to have five lore masters. Um, wildfire, maybe? Fuck it. Let's do wildfire on Roderick. Can I still summon something? No. Because I really need to turn invisible. 
I can do like what five action points. Earth resistance. I can do fire resistance. Or maybe yeah yeah I can do that totally. I got an invis potion right here. Three action points. So let's do fire resist. Or do I want to do it on Medora? Yeah, sure. Wait, what? Am I like not seeing this right or what? I'm pretty fucking sure I had 8 action points. And this says 5, but somehow it took 7. So what the fuck's going on in here? Are you fucking kidding me, game? It's total bullshit. Six, seven. Ice elemental. Summon it anywhere. Come on. There we go. And invisible. There we go. Okay, Madora. What was your fire resist anyway? Oh, you had like a ton of resist. Yeah, like 80. Okay then. Where's that son of a bitch? He's right here. So I guess we can just ram. Kinda. Not really. Oh, yes. There we go. What can I do to this guy? Four action points. Give me that melee power stance. Boom, baby, get wrecked. Hell yeah. Now it's Roderick's time. I can. I should be able to flurry here for sure. This is four. Boom. And flurry. Look at that combo. Isn't that neat? It's fucking awesome what that is. He has 50% from Bully. And now they're still invulnerable. So what the fuck do we do now? Do I just have to use water? No, don't kill it, shit! He's gonna kill it. I'm not gonna be able to test this sound. Oh shit, Scarlet, you're dead. God damn it. What the fuck do I do against these guys? Do I just try and run away from them? So confused. Maybe I need to use rain. What did I think of that? Like the spiders are useless here. Yep. They are basically meat shields. So Scarlet. Maybe she can. I don't know. Use a rain spell or something like that. How about freezing touch? Three action points. What? Is it immune or... Didn't tell me anything, it didn't give me any feedback. What the hell's going on in here? Blitzbolt? I don't fucking know at this time. What the fuck do I do? Invulnerable. Nothing works. Okay, so we are going to use rain. How much does rain cost? Four action points. You can only use one of them. Six. Wait a minute. Six. Okay, we can use that one. Let's use the ice shard on this guy, maybe. Yes, yes, yes. There we go. Fuck. Fuck, did I hit... Piece of shit. 
fucking driving me crazy game. Did I fucking hit him or not? I think I didn't hit him. Okay, give me... Like, I have nothing that has water on it. Shit. I got like ice wall. Slow current. Let's try that one. Again, it doesn't say anything. What the fuck is going on, dude? Void aura. I don't know what the fuck this is, but this is bullshit. Okay, let's try this again. So what do we have? Ice wall. Immune to burning. Don't really have anything. Um, I could jump away and grab this loot over here. What the hell? No, oh, that's just a tent. Okay. Or how much? I can just walk there actually. Fuck it. Of course. Should have seen that coming. Roderick, do you have any good spells? What is this? Cleansing water? No. Ice elemental, water shield scroll, tornado, remove purification. God damn it, nobody has a water spell. Should I use this scroll? Might need it. Okay, well, Roderick is almost immune to fire. So. I'm just gonna go ahead and explore the area with him. Fuck this shit. And he has like 12 action points per turn, he has wildfire and stuff on him. So if they have they're gonna have a hard time catching up to him. <clears throat> Although this is quite annoying to keep walking like this. We got some bones, okay. Let's move. Actually, I can move this way. Just move this way. Right about there. Move here. And let's. We will grab those bones, sure. <coughs> Spiders are dead. Void aura. So annoying. Maybe I should just summon a fire elemental because they're they're gonna heal him. That would be pretty funny. Okay, who's next? Scarlet is next actually. So let's go ahead and just do that. Although this is kinda tricky. Can I? Let's try and do this. Okay, I can run away with just her. So that's pretty good. Wasted that potion for nothing. Let's get the elemental in here. There we go. And I'm gonna get the fuck out of here with Scarlet. Ah, oh, shit. Okay, never mind. Good luck, guys. Okay, Johan. You got one chance. <coughs> Shoot some motherfuckers. Can you shoot those? No. Okay, just hit this guy, please. Okay. They're immune to everything. Oh shit. I think they're too far away though. No way they can get to me. Okay, Roderick, Madora is on her ass. Like usual. What else do we have here? Am I gonna need like more perception for this shit? Fuck, maybe I should have brought Scarlet. Hello there. Hello there. Let me just do this. Aha! Uh -huh. 
How many souls were sacrificed to create a bloodstone this powerful? Give me that. Can I not grab it? Oh, do I need to destroy this thing first? Look at this, again it doesn't show me that I can interact with it. It's so bullshit. Why you do this game? Make it clear for your player that you can actually interact with this because I could easily try and attack everything. Like I can attack I can try and attack this pillar, right? If I'm if I have the right spell or the right weapon, the right strength, why wouldn't this pillar um, give and just get crushed, right? Like get destroyed and have this whole thing fall off. But we both know the player and the developer that that's not possible because this this is not part of the game, right? It's just you know the background, the freaking the area that you explore, right? So if we look at this in contrast to that, they're the same, right? Like this this is pretty much the same thing. So why should the player assume that this is destructible, but this is not? Like, there's no way to do that, unless you have a keen eye and see that health bar up there. And then you have to press control or use a spell or some shit to see that, oh, I can actually interact with this. But you gotta make it clear. Like, you got... You got other shit like... This stuff, for instance, this coal basket, it clearly shows that you can interact with it. Why not make it the same for this shit as well? Yeah. Rant over. It's just really dumb, though. What the fuck are they doing? Oh, it's Medora, and she has like immunity to fire shield. Right, I mean to fire. So fucking dumb, though. Okay. Oh shit, they're going for Jahan. <clears throat> okay, why are these fellows still in combat? Okay, Jahan. Actually, I could have went there with Jahan. Can I just flee combat? What the fuck? Goblin village. What the fuck, game? <laughs> Whatever. Alright, time to destroy this thing once and for all. Uh, yeah. Uh, what? Are you kidding me right now? Oh, we made some progress. Okay, it's killable. It's killable, guys. But this might take a while, actually. So, I think I'm gonna... We're gonna fast forward and into the next fast forward into the next video and there I will uh, show you the conclusion of this freaking mess also gotta bring Jahan back and all sorts of bullshit but yeah guys make sure to like this video leave a comment subscribe thank you for watching and I'll see you next time bye bye fucking pieces of shit